I'm John with Servup here and I'm going to show you how to use the Hawk 5B Hardness Test Kit. So inside your test kit you're going to have a few items. The first thing you're going to need to use is the little bottle that comes with it. So you want to open up your cold faucet, let it run for a little bit, get a good clean sample. We'll slow it down and we just end up filling up our test bottle. We'll fill it a couple times, give it a good rinsing, and then fill it all the way up to the top. Now, the other bottle we're gonna use is the other empty jar that comes with it. Rinse that out a little bit too. Dump it out, make sure it's empty, and we just wanna put that over top of the, the test tube, flip it upside down and get all that sample in there. Shake it around a little, get it all in. And now, what you're going to do is use the powder that actually comes with it and the scooper that's included also. Fill that scooper right level with the top and dump one level scoop right into there. So you can mix it around a little bit and we do have a water softener here and it looks like it's working because it's blue. So anything you get that's kind of a purplish color to a blue color will indicate soft water. So now if you wanted to actually check hard water, I have a sample of that too here. You can sometimes get this on your outside faucet if it's not connected to your water softener or if you're putting in a new water softener, this would be just your regular city or well water. You can rinse out the jar that you have, make sure we get it good and clean. Same thing with the little sample vial. Rinse that out a couple times. Fill it up one time all the way to the top as high as you can get it. Make sure this is empty. And get all that sample right in that bottle. Shake it around a little. Again, one level scoop of the reagent. Dump it in there. And this time we don't get a blue or a purple. We get more of a pink color. So now we want to get that pink, see how many drops it will actually take to get it to a blue. So we want to use the eyedropper, fill it up, and keep it level, straight up and down, and count how many drops it takes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Shake it around a little, make sure everything's getting mixed up. 10, 11, and it's kind of changing a purple color for us. So we go one more drop, 12. Now it went from that purple to a nice blue color. And that will mean that you have 12 grains of hardness in your water. If you want to convert that into parts per million, you multiply it by 17.1. So 12 times 17.1 in this case will give you how many parts per million. And you can get this hardness test kit at servapure.com.